The Raiders are hoping to keep their record perfect. That is the goal at New England this weekend. Ron Futrell joins us now with the very latest news from the sports books, where the betters seem to be doing quite well early in the season. So here we are, week three of the NFL season, and the sports books are having to make a lot of adjustments because of all the injuries in the NFL. We always have a lot of injuries over the course of the season, but it's been kind of odd this year. It seems like we're getting them early. I don't know if that's because uh, we didn't have any preseason games and in, uh, in uh, getting in shape or anything, but uh, it does make it more difficult uh, for us. Uh, obviously, when a quarterback goes out, uh, you know, or a key uh, wide receiver or something, but uh, it does make it uh, difficult. Now, through the first two weeks of the NFL season, the betters have been winning. Last week, 13 favorites covered the point spread, and betters like playing favorites. One underdog that won outright was the Raiders on Monday night. This week, the Raiders are underdogs once again at New England. Actually, the Raider money came in yesterday. We were at six, uh, drove the line down to five. Uh, we have had some money come in on the uh, favorite now. We're back up to five and a half, but uh, very exciting. We got our uh, undefeated Raiders going uh, against uh, Cam Newton in New England. Uh, this atmosphere in the book last Monday was unbelievable. We haven't had a Monday night like that. Uh, the book was full of Raider fans and everything. So there you have it. The Raiders getting set to take on the New England Patriots, trying to keep their record undefeated so far in this young season, and taking on Cam Newton. We'll see how they can do on Sunday. At the Mirage, I'm Ron Futrell, 8 Sports Now.